What are cable shielding and armor? What do they do and what makes them different? In this video, we'll introduce you to these two important cable basics. Shielding works to prevent signal leakage and electrostatic interference from nearby cables. Their signals stay strong and uninterrupted as they move from one point to another. Shielding is the layer located between a cable's insulation and its jacketing. It's made of conductive metal, commonly copper or aluminum foil. There are several types of shielding to choose from, foil, braid, spiral, and combination shields. Foil shielding is made of aluminum foil laminated to a polyester or polypropylene film. It's a lightweight, inexpensive option. Foil is the only type of shielding that can completely cover the cable's surface, so it's the best option to protect against electrostatic interference. This is especially true for data cables, which require strong signal protection. Braid shielding looks exactly like it sounds, strands of metal braided together. Braid shielding is heavier and bulkier than foil shielding, but it's more structurally sound, flexible, and has a longer flex life. Braid shields protect against low-frequency interference, or noise. They're usually made of copper and can be coated. One disadvantage of braid shields is they can't provide full coverage. They typically cover 65 to 90 percent of the cable. The numerous strands of a braid shield are harder to terminate than other shields, requiring crimping or clamping or even pigtailing. Some cables have both a foil shield and a braid shield. Together this is called a combination shield. By layering the shielding methods, the wire gets the best of both worlds. The 100% coverage of the foil and the low frequency resistance and physical strength of the braid. Spiral shielding is another option. Metal is wrapped in a spiral around and up the conductor. It's flexible and has a long flex life. Spiral shields are commonly used for audio applications. They're usually ineffective above the audio frequency range. Unlike shielding, which protects the integrity of the signal, armor is primarily used to prevent physical damage to the cable itself. Armor is a tough wrapping used on the outside of the cable. It's usually made of steel or aluminum and can safeguard electronic, instrumentation, and control cables in hazardous environments. Some jacket materials are as tough as armor and can protect cables from their surroundings, but armor's extra durability and strength may be necessary for more extreme applications. Now that you know more about your shielding and armor options, you're one step closer to finding the most appropriate solution for your specific cable needs. Here at Allied Wire and Cable, we've given our customers the best in customer service, product selection, and quality for over 25 years. We carry a wide variety of high-quality products for numerous industries, automotive, military, OEMs, and more. Allied Wire and Cable is ISO 9001-2008 certified. The products you receive will be of the highest quality available. To help customize your products, we offer a variety of value-added services, including striping, twisting, braiding, cut and strip, custom packaging, and special labeling, to name just a few. When you need something extraordinary, our experienced sales reps and engineers can help you design a custom cable from start to finish that fits your application perfectly. We guarantee that all orders on stock materials received by 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time will ship out the same day. And with our low minimum of just $50, you can get the amount you want in the time frame you need. A designated sales representative will handle your account personally. That means one point of contact and the trust and assurance that comes with having a personal relationship with our customers. For more information about the products you've seen in this demo, contact Allied Wire and Cable today. Call 1-888-325-1788 or visit our website at www.awcwire.com.